If he doesn't have the experience or the knowledge that Ryan Fitzpatrick possesses, but I believe because of his legs, I, be, I believe because he's more athletic, he probably makes them more of a threat. Considering how well he played in that playoff game, maybe as he wasn't, he didn't know he wasn't supposed to play that well, Skip. Maybe coming in off the bench, but now there's a different level of expectations from him. I think the thing is, Skip, no one expected what we got when they played the Bucks in the playoff. So, but man, that's Tyler Hollick, man, come on, bro. What, what you expect? Mm. And he exceeded expectations. The Buccaneers walked off that field thinking, we're pretty lucky to dodge that young man's ball. And think about it, Skip. Of all the quarterbacks that that defense yep. faced, he can make a he can make a case that he played better against that defense than all the rest of it. Well, he did. In fact, they. Were of Deami Brown with Terry McLaurin and Antonio Gibson and Logan Thomas. They've got some players on offense. Yeah, they definitely do. Their mission this offseason, much like the Giants, was to get some playmakers and some speed on the field. Heineke throws and caught. Nice grab by the rookie. Deami Brown up to get it. And a completion for their first first down of 22 yards. Uh, looked like he had Humphreys right down the middle, probably hits his head on the goalpost. Instead, he comes back to Deami Brown, the rookie like you. Deami Brown is beyond his years in route running already. Here's a grab for a first down, McLaurin. We have right here James Bradbury on Terry McLaurin. Heineke, good protection. There he is. Pass is caught, McLaurin. This is route running at its finest. See how he turns James Bradbury around. He pushes. It looks like he's going to do a double move. He slows down, accelerates, and that acceleration is what got Bradbury's hips turned. And then once that happens, yeah, he's beat. You got him all day. Five first downs on this drive. Heineke ends on McLaurin. Touchdown. But by alignment and the speed, he threatens him. And see how he's on his outside? Then it just opens up scrimmage. Time for first with 11 touchdowns as Heineken throws. He's got his man, the tight end, Thomas. Heineken six for six on this possession. First down. Pass caught. Deami Brown last year. Pass is behind, but caught. McLaurin gets back into the fun. Down near the 45. Run. Heineke throws, pass caught. McLaurin again. And they're going to give him a first down. They're just playing. Little pump fake, and now a throw to from McKissick. Down the sideline. McKissick out of bounds. 56 yards along his play of the game. Heineke throws it in the end zone. Touchdown! What a throw, and Ricky Seals Jones is there. Similar route to what we saw from JD McKissick, only from a tight split. And Heineke doesn't like it initially, and then he just decides, you know, he's running out of time. He's just going to throw it up high and see if he can go up and get it. Hey, what a chance. And that's. Heineken throws, and he's picked. Bradbury. And the first turnover of the game sets up the Giants. Two minutes to be exact with a timeout. And Taylor Heineke coming off that interception has it all out in front of him. That's McLaurin and Bradbury. Heineke underneath McKissick. Makes a move and he's short. Later when they need to get a field goal out on the field if it comes down to that. Good strong throw and that's caught by Logan Thomas. That's where I'd go. Heineke looks to his right and finds the rookie, Deami Brown. And Ron Rivera is going to use the timeout here. Can't spike it if you're short. 
It's third down here. Humphreys, first down, out of bounds. Such a great call by Scott Turner, the offensive coordinator. They're anticipating man coverage. That's what they're going to get. And they run the rub route. So they, they get Logan Tom. Marks to Humphreys. Here's one to McLaurin. Under 20 to go, no time up. Good snap, good hold. Kick is good. Washington wins it. And there's the quarterback, signed as the quarantine quarterback. And a placeholder for the placeholder for Washington. And boy, did he earn it. Taylor, congratulations on the win. I'm sure you can hear these fans chanting your name. How does that feel, by the way? Yeah, it's pretty, pretty wild, you know? Just thinking back about, you know, last year at this time, I was at home taking classes. So, you know, it's an unbelievable journey. And, uh, you know, this is a great way to start off.